Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to episode 53 of our Mellion Let's Play. We continue from turn 150. Now there's still a couple portals in our territory. Uh, as we expand it into the mountains, we don't have enough heroes in the right places, so it's gonna be some tough spots here. And our war with our former ogre allies is gonna hurt us a little bit as they have a full army slip through. As you can see, we don't have any army nearby, so um, maybe it's time for a couple more armies. That might be what we need. So all those things are what we have to consider. First things first, we're not balanced and I prefer to start off balanced versus everything else. So are we canceling someone? We will. That location is easy to cover. Okay, they spawned a cultist, not a big deal, but you can see the corruption is ready getting there. Both of them are young, so it's not like I can cancel them. Um, I'll have both of them get there because we might need multiple people to do the assassination on that hero that they just summoned in this army that we are trying to keep alive. We will take... Huh. I think unyielding might be the best here. Our supremacy is assured. They also summoned one. And you can see the corruption just going hard in all these portals. So that's going to be closed next turn. There's still two more turns on that one. This one should be closed this turn. We'll close it first, then deal with the cultists right after. That worked out perfectly. Some old news. Many, many old news. Okay, so that's all done. This army, as I mentioned, can't no really do anything about it. We don't know a lot about the army composition either. We could potentially move this force back. Alchemist of I don't know, portal first. Metal and fire. Kill next. Shugan Gun Lord reporting. Earn the Emperor's love. Kneel. I think I'm gonna run this army back. Child of the Nine. So what we're gonna do we is have them cover for this situation. Because we're not gonna have a fresh army out fast enough. Over here. We're thinking about keeping the portal because I want to go into it. Stand against evil. It has the honor of joining Cafe. I'm thinking about going in next turn. Sure, the front line is not in best shape, but I think we'll be fine. I shall summon devastation. We've got the nine percent trait, which helps. We might come under attack by the toll and lose this right after. Yeah. One point in. Uh, we have a lot of in, and we actually wanted to delete some of the young characters. That is a bummer. I mean, we'll just recruit another young character. We have a lot of alchemist slots. Alchemist and uh, we could definitely use more income. Oh, unfortunately, it's another in character. Hmm. Young. Oh, you are in. Yep, you're also in a slot that a can be easily covered in the future. Celestial. We'll temporarily delete him. All right, so main army is in good place, ready to go into a portal next turn. Ready to sacrifice ready to this. But we'll still build it. In case we can keep it, who knows, right? You're gonna chill here. From here, we shall tell. Ruin will fall upon them. Before they steal any of our tech. He doesn't have to take care of rebellions anymore, so it's now just about the armies. 
I also don't think he has to take care of the portal. I think I have someone coming. Correct. Okay, so far the cultists have been easy to kill. Shogun Gun Lord reporting. Fly the Emperor's flag. Enemy. Only one I listen to is Moon. Enemy agent. Enemy camp. I'm the one in charge, man. Enemy here. camp. Shogun Gun Lord reporting. It suits my. We take purpose. them and then we march south. We're getting siege here, which is interesting because I don't know why they're not confident in beating us. But we'll let them keep Another sieging. Time. We're not in a rush to get over here. There's also a portal here, which is a mess. The elements array against us. See, now I believe the delegate value is going to be acceptable for Tsalsal's army. We can go back to having a lot of, you know, air cavalry units in the future. They will earn but right now... We're gonna try to keep this army efficient so they can do stuff for us. Oh, great. Got 4% additional. We'll be going back to encampment. Quick fill up. And we can even. Trade these in. Service and then get three more. So this is how we stay efficient. Amazingly, Suryu has 165 health. It's okay. I can heal him on the battlefield when we do actually fight, which, you know, we eventually will when we fight this. But for that fight, we took it easy. I can't reach them. Hmm. I'm going to let you go out and kill him. Come back next turn. I'm gonna just hang out. I don't know where he wants to go, but we don't have to go anywhere. Yeah, that's fine. It's until our beacon of hope. So he's supposed to crush this camp down here. I'm supposed to go over here. Lord Magistrate reporting. It benefits the Empire. All right, we'll be picking that up next turn. I have no idea what's Certainly. going on here. We're not at war with them, I have only which is also super weird. Discussion. But um, we'll leave them be. The secrets of Azir. That portal. Alchemist of Shangyang. We're on top of it. Secrets. They will suffer elemental wrath. Good. The murder streak continues. The house of secrets. This part is a mess, and we kind of expected it, so I'm not going to be too concerned about it. Is there still a camp? I think there is still a camp here. I don't know if I want to go in kind of blind. Dragon blooded sugar. No, no, no. I want her to come out. No, come out. Descended from celestial what part of glory. come out of the this army, don't you understand? They will never expect uh, there we go. The dragon blooded. Alchemist of the House of Secrets. We'll go back here to heal. They can rejoin us next turn. I guess we can do the camp since I have more important Shogun targets up in the Lord north. Reporting. So we'll go there. I will be we heal obeyed. even in March. Redouble your speed. Is terrain's okay. Temp climate's not too bad. I still don't think we'll reach it in one turn. We might have to turn over here as well because there's a there's an army of them somewhere over here. I don't know how strong it is. If it's like something our garrison can take care of, we then we don't have to go. But um, we don't know. Our lovely ambush party, uh, no longer ambush, discovered. It's okay. Go back to ambush. Um, just healing. Defending our city for two turns. They're going to die here with us, which is part of the plan. Alright, we're not leveling any of them up. That's going to be young. 
And that's gonna be in perfect. And that's gonna be in Yan right here. So this can be anything. I'm gonna opt for what is our one turn tech? Oh, right here. We're doing in next turn, so this is going to be young. Uh, actually, I want the discount building, so let's do that. Compass already? Oh, we got that. Okay, seems like it's right. Fire and Mm, yeah, they have a camp. They don't have any more land left. They have one settlement. They also only have camp. They're far away. It help it. They only have one in the beginning, anyways. They also have only one left. So we're about to wipe this out. 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 So four of them are gone, and we'll be at war with only two factions plus all the chaos factions, which we cannot piece out, which is why they're not here. Not too bad. What about missions? I think we did a few. Okay, and we're we're two we're one turn away from borrowing this force, which might actually help us here. Telltale might get some help. None shall question me. How is this an army? I mean, she's doing really badly, which I'm perfectly happy about because they were in the soul race with us, and now they're just not, because their faction is just. Completely destroyed. Oh? They had enough of the sieging? Um, I'm not gonna defend this actually. We want the army dead. They still didn't take it, they burned it another tier. I lost one of your armies. Are you here for? No, you guys fight your own Skaven battles. That's the army I was worried about. It doesn't look that impressive. Gorger is the strongest unit. Now our garrison is not impressive either, so this... We'll try. No promises. I don't have a good feeling about this, but... We'll give it a shot. We're probably gonna have to guard that center. Which has six different passages that can get in. A little bit too many. We might just make a square in the middle instead of defending six. We'll see. We'll see how they split their forces. Alright, let's see, let's see. Four, all four directions. Great. Um, I only have 500 supplies. I think it's going to go to a tower. Except the center has no towers. That is very interesting. That means I can't really... I mean, all the other points will get taken. Unless I'm betting that they ignore the points, thus giving me time. So maybe we'll take that one. We're pulling everyone back. They're going to flood in. The thing is, all four directions kind of annoying. Okay. Maybe in front of it, and then we can probably build um, a monument or something here. Long spears. Never conquered. I think we'll do spear units God. in front of each of these. Warrior. Alright, we'll block all six. How about that? We block all six entrance. We'll go to whomever. I mean, we probably, whoever gets attacked, they go, and then we give them an Inyan bonus, right? That's kind of the, the plan. Crossbow, I guess we'll, we'll split them across the four different areas first. The I'll sit in the middle. We have one cavalry unit. Which might be a good distraction force. But 
the ogres, I just remember, are all faster than me. So I might actually just sit in the middle and go out when we have some target to chase. Think not of yourselves. Think of the dragons. Think of Cathay's immortal grace. I feel like this might be their weakest side, so hopefully we can pull these units later. This might be their strongest side because they have their... board with them. I feel like probably Monuments is what we want. Giving ourselves 15 points of melee defense and 10 points of leadership might be the best thing. I don't even think towers that worth it because we can't protect any of the outer points, so they are probably going to get destroyed. These might actually help us. And we're going to build these when we can. Oh! Did they just... Is that a spell? I'm not familiar with the ogre spell, but that just sort of summoned a, a stone horn image into our unit's face and uh, killed a bunch of them. Or actually didn't kill any of them, but injured a bunch of them. Because the spell damage is split across all units that's hit. So that actually didn't didn't hurt us that badly, to be honest. More of that is fine. Alright, this is the tower we build, because I figured this side has a lot of units, but if we can pick them off, maybe. Maybe we have an advantage somewhere. Alright, they're going for the capture first. Are they see I also decided to build this because I don't think anyone will go capture that. Or at least it'll take them a while to capture that. I want this. Okay, monuments up. We got all the defense bonus that we want. Celestial Gonna give this side the amplifier because they're coming first. And since that's their enemy lord, we're gonna actually use the summon on here. Yeah, we gotta block every entrance because they have a lot of mobile units that might try to flank everywhere. The Celestial Faithful! Seems like they're not interested here. Spears! Thought! All right, we're gonna block Harmony! that one and shift Seeking people around. Move in yeah, we're gonna do a cheap barricade here. Hope it works. Alright, seems like this part's actually defended. I'm gonna go here. March in ordered ranks. Defend the realm for the moon dragon. Alright, add some units over here real quick. Sanyang's faithful. Sent by dragons. Defenders of Cafe. Actually, actually, why don't we flank? That's actually a bad spot too, but because they have a lord here, and also because this line's cratering, you know, just stay here, just stay here. All right, we cannot get here fast enough. Oh, they're coming up. Never mind, never mind. Is that the only one left? There's a lot of enemies here, but we can't just pull. But just pulling him doesn't do much. I guess we have to add the melee units here. And then they can go here. We just kill him. I'm fighting him. I, don't sh I shouldn't be fighting him. I should just boost. Ah. He's gonna bounce back though. That's fine. Ah, uh, got the flank. Too many of them. Too many directions. Retreat with Crossbow. 
Bowman. Yeah, we're just providing some melee units here. I hope most of these will bounce back. It's possible. Okay. I mean, literally our best units are here, so I'm actually not so worried. I don't understand how he's not dying. 100 health. We stabbed him to death. Trying to get them to shoot. Alright, they bounce back. These bounce back. Alright, let me try to kill him. I'm on horseback so I can get there quickly. Nobblers, not gonna worry too much about them. Do we have any of the outside points still in our hands? Okay, we do. So we'll pop some towers to help us. That's the only side? That's the only side. Okay. Oh, come on. How did we not... Lighting the way! Celestial Splendor! A clear core. How do we bump into that? My path is known. Uh oh, this side's Warrior cratering. I stand ready. No, 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 you stay, you stay put, you stay put. No need to move. I will go. Behold, Azir's might. A retreat. Away the draw. Hmm, being chased. Stone away. Lighting the way. Stone and steel. Wind and fire! Jade warriors! A necessity! We'll stay here and see if we can cast a couple of spells. The celestial wind! Sound of it. Mm. Good effort. The map was a little too open. Not enough choke points. I wonder if they'll take the settlement or would they like raid it? And they will take it. Okay, that's not bad. That's a good result, actually. I think they're all balanced, so it's not going to hurt our Eon balance here. Although we are not balanced. Three points, Young. What happened? Could I take my brother's army and potentially balance it because we have enough? Ah, we're so close. Is it Yang or in? Ah, it's actually in. So next turn I can take it, but that's not going to work for this turn. But what if I take out the camp this turn? That would be enough to... Um... Oh, but I'm, am I close enough to take out the camp? Probably not. Yeah, that, that would be how we can do it. But uh, unfortunately, we cannot reach it this turn. Three point Yang, you say. We hire a general. We hire a recruitment general for our next army, so like a setup, like a intermediate guy. Who's optimistic. And of course, we're gonna exploit the cheapness. And also reduce the upkeep. Unfortunately, we can't pick this up. That would help a lot, but uh, that's fine. Surely a gift from he can get dragons. us started on the key units. Your services are required. Obedience is all I ask. There is no cause no right. Easy balance. So despite the 4% increase, we're still 20k. Might be even higher, because I don't know if you're refreshed after the harmony balance. Lord Magistrate reporting. We're taking this. Celestial Empire Mergers. They're actually wise. growing in size. It's a horde faction. It's interesting that there's a Cafe horde faction being formed over here. Um, I'm racing for the portal. I'm racing for this. Although we cannot reach it this turn. Allocate shifts as required. 
So we'll be able to destroy them next turn. Is it portal time? I think it is portal time. We crush this army first. Might of the storm. Just so that we don't have them running around. The single entities are all full health, so there's really no point to actually fight that one. Let's get some leadership. I guess we're going into our first... I'm gonna scout first. What are we facing? There's nothing here. I'm kind of tempted to just wipe out the tones here. There's nothing here too. Like, I can wipe out the tone and then go to the portal, It'll still be there. No one's competing in the Corns realm, so it's like, we're not going to miss out on anything. Oh, you know what? That's what we will do. We're going to wipe out the tones first. Why do we walk so little? Huh. Yeah, we'll keep that on, which is going to mess us up here. I mean, but it's already a total mess here, so it's not going to be anything worse than what it is like we're gonna get rebellions all that stuff and we don't have armies in this area it's gonna be a slight nightmare since they're supposed to go back and take care of this but maybe they don't have to maybe Sima Yi should just do that right the camps we can kind of ignore and just go for these actually we don't have to ignore this to go for that i can take this and then march up and they'll still be fine dismantle them make your ancestors proud we're gonna ignore that. Natural authority. We must be tireless. Right, now we can definitely strike that next turn. So it's gonna be the same thing, right? We just got rid of something faster. It is mine by blood right. Alchemist of Shang Yang. She left the army to kill someone. Now she can rejoin the army. This army... Maybe you can come do some... Camp hunting? Doesn't look like we're gonna get attacked. We can go take care of that one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Tall Tall's facing... A lot of stuff again. I only follow grandfather. Leave me be. All right, we got a big fight here, which we probably have to fight. We probably will lose this, but we can retake it. Yep. Child of the nine. All right, who hasn't moved? Dragon hasn't moved, but he doesn't need to move. Right, do we go down, take care of this, or we let Samayi do it? Because Samayi can go to here next turn, and then we just chase after this army. Because the thing is, if we want Melian to go in here, someone needs to stay behind. And they're probably better the be dragons. the one. Yeah. Fly the Emperor's flag. All right, Samayi can take care of the rebellions. We need more army. That that much is clear. So we're getting that recruitment lord up. We keep getting discovered. I mean, my brother probably slightly confused. Maybe he gets the message. Maybe he doesn't. So this also has a fight. Aside from that, everyone has moved. He's someone we're not deleting, so... I'm probably going to either delete her or just walk her back to the Imperial Road. Ooh, what do we want here? There's too many open slots, not enough things to really build here, to be honest. Is it ever going to be in danger? Not really. I think it's pretty interior at this point. So this makes sense. This probably makes sense. If global recruitment ever gets reduced when you have 10 copies, then we probably want that. 
and then we can even do like the other the other in yang set with the defensive buildings but i still don't i still think that's maybe a waste so maybe that's not what we're gonna do here Um, he siege and then left, which pretty awesome. I think it's because this is damage. We lost the point of in as well. That's probably what happened with the three point swing. Yeah, Tal Tal's coming. You are trying to get this. Schematics from Nankao. Okay, reminding myself, Talsal still has a big fight to fight. 2v1. Obey me. But just want to check everything else first. I think we did sort of check this. We're missing one point of bar with that army. Which will help quite a bit. 10 points. Probably just a mission away to pick up this army. War sleds are good. To war. I. Born. Zhao Ming. Okay. Okay. We fight. Cao Cao's fight here. We need to fight it well. He has a pretty fragile situation here. We can fight in this stance, to be honest. If we get attacked in it, but. Uh, My ancestors require it. Which army do we want to face first? Oh, not not a soul grinder. The fly master serves only Nurgle. Uh, uh, no. This is the more annoying army. I think we fight him first. Let them come in slightly lagging behind. Give us a little bit of time to heal up some of our single entities. The Soul Grinders, I think, they're going to be the big. I mean, other than the Bloodthirster, these two are the biggest problem. Everyone else, everyone else. I mean, a lot of health, but manageable. Really, from behind us. That changes things. We're low ground. They're going to charge us because they're coming in from behind us. I hate this. And I don't have a good solution here. Like, sure, we can deploy here, which seems to be like the most logical setup, right? We kind of hit them as they approach us, but not really. And then when they come, we can't try to hit them either. Like, we're not going to do this, right? That feels good, but then they just charge us this direction and none of our range units can hit them. Unless they want to group with their allies. That would be a blessing. Right? That would... Mm, maybe that's what we do. We definitely need a huddle over here where we just heal our single entities real quick. Only have four of them. We do have a lot of units that we can throw at the enemy, right, to buy us some time, which is good. Wind and fire. Heal, 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 heal. They're pulling back. Never but, but you know they're going to come back. Right? That's the thing. Like, they're not going to permanently stay back. That's too far. I was like, can we go to the edge? I'm not going to move. I feel like if I move, we're going to have more problems. Um... 
We're gonna stay here. Just try to get this guy into like a suitable health. I don't know. I mean, at least they will heal up, and then they're gonna have to give up most of their health in this fight. They're definitely not gonna move. Oh, I'm getting hit by spells. Uh, I can't do. Can you move? Can you move? Can you... There's. Oh, it's a summon. It's a summon. That's okay. Uh, Loma. That's why we need you. Archers as well. Cannons can shoot like at that angle. Oh, they're burning up already. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's their... Wait, there's... Oh, I don't know, actually. With Legion of Chaos, it could be anything. Like, the army ability and stuff. Alright, here they come. They're sending the flying units up first. Gonna respond. It's okay. They probably just land on us, and we can just defend against that. The bloodthirster is a big problem. Can we target him? Or actually, can we target the the, the soul grinder, which is I think a bigger problem. We're not healthy, but like, I still like that matchup. All right, if they're gonna pull back, then we're gonna go here. I'm gonna grind down that soul grinder. Okay, they they seem to be all gathering up here for the attack, which is fine. All right, we're gonna be able to fight here. Are they? Oh, oh, another another summon. Order and harmony on gilded foot. Here comes the Bloodthirster. Gonna have to use him to fight the Bloodthirster for sure. How is the cannon firing backwards? Who's firing that? Now we're getting hit with spells. Pendulum? They can use Pendulum? Uh, I don't know if we can beat the Bloodthirster here. Gonna give myself... Oh my god, a lot of things. A lot of nasty spells. I don't feel like he's firing. Oh, there we go. Okay. Wait, wait. I want to be in that fight. Okay, they got all the Zinch stuff. They got all the nasty Nurgle stuff. They got the Fury Summon, which I think is a corn move. Not a fun faction to fight against. Maybe Tal's army just need a reset. Oh, I think I think that the soul grinder is actually hitting me right now. Yeah, I think I'm actually getting hit by the soul grinder. I don't think I can beat him in the air. I don't think this is a fight that we want. Alright, throw them over here. Let him land. I want to fly over my single entities, although, yeah, make sure I ping him. Get him a heal. We're gonna fly down. Shield ourselves, And then we're gonna use, uh, this. Right... Here. Long spears! Explode on them. There we go. Oh, 
Alright, I mean, it's gonna come down to how good our two Sentinels can deal with their single entities. That guy's free hitting, which is terrible. Is that another pendulum? Oh no, Nurgle spell. Not any better. Oh man, I got crushed by the Bloodthirster. Expected. Yeah, I don't know how we're gonna deal with that. Another summon? How many Chaos Spheres? I thought it was two use only. Okay, just as we turn, we got hit with a spell. Awesome. And another spell. This one's brutal. We got absolutely crushed. It's just the two unbreakable guys gonna fight it out to the end. Let me see if I can sneak some shots. Or no, I'm routed. All right, just unbreakable fight to the death. Everyone else is gone. This was a spell different situation. I think their army ability just picks up spells from like every single one of the Chaos Gods and yeah, it's wiping the floor with us. Cause like they have no Zinch units, right? But they're using a lot of Zinch spells. Pendulum, the big bombardment one as well. They have too much health. They're basically getting debuffed. Yeah, and Bloodthirster is insane. I think this is the second time Tulsa's army has fallen. Completely. I mean, he has uh, immortality. He's not gonna die. But um, I guess it's time for a revamp. He needs an alchemist, anyways. Guadia has died from attrition after getting a plague, getting hit with some other spell. Yet yeah, enfeebling full. That one was not close. I don't know what the system think. That's like not a close defeat. Absolutely wiped the floor against us. This is a bit rough. We still have an army behind them that can help us defend, and Tultal's not technically, you know, gone. He's still on the field, which doesn't give us any comfort. Like, we can certainly go back here and muster up a temporary defense, right? Whatever we can get. We might even just... Spam it out. I don't know if they'll siege us. If they siege us, it's obviously not going to work. But at least we have... Oh, we don't have a garrison. So it's probably a pipe dream. This army's probably doomed. Also's not in good shape. But, um... We'll pick up this. We'll get the Great Bastion if we can. It befits my high station. We are going to be preparing ourselves for... The destruction of Tal Tal's army. We do have this defensive force still behind, so I'm not too concerned. And Smai is also coming up in this area. We do have two armies nearby. All right, everything else has been looked at. I think this is end turn time. Our money looks good, simply because we um, just lost a lot of units. Uh, not looking for quick deals. I want to know what he thinks what about his territory still. 4.4, 6.4, 6.4, 6.4, 6.4, 6.4, 5. The one we want costs a lot. 
This one's only six point something, but there's no point to take it. This one's also kind of cheap, but also... Oh, that one's not even considered because it's being siege. It's dangerous. This one's also cheap, but uh, also... It's actually a choke point. They actually have to take it to come to us, which is what's ruining them. Gives the garrison some time to build up. Yeah. Not an ideal scenario here. Do we want to just summon the general, like, say, here and start pumping out units? I don't think it'll be fast enough. Maybe we lose it. Sun Tzu is in the area. He'll be the one defending. That might be the play. Lord Magistrate reporting. A strong right. man solved a celestial court. Maybe Cao Cao doesn't get, you know, five Through air units that doesn't do much for us. Favor. He wants to declare war. Nope. It's not important right now. Defend your own land. Alright, this is getting attacked again. Are they going to take it? Are they not going to take it? They finally took it. Okay. Whoa. Veil of my Oh, newly conquer land. This is the portal we left open. I mean, they didn't take it, but this is what happens when you leave a portal open too long. I'm surprised the rebels attack right away. Although that's probably not the rebel spawn, that's just like the spawn that comes out of the portals. Caught by the dragons themselves. Master of the province. Quick march. He's oh wow. Yeah. A good army to drag them out for us. Thank you. Well, that's not gonna be hard. He's going here. Scrag made it out. So there's a siege and then another army play just popped over, I'm guessing. We lost this to a rebel force, which isn't too bad. We are getting siege, so those recruits never came. And they never will. Because Hellsol's not getting any help. He's just gonna stall. I can go rescue him, but that's kind of messing up our other plans. Sima Yi can also rescue him. Or have Sima Yi watch Cao Cao die, which one's more fitting. Because he's supposed to go here. He has a job too. We might lose more land if we don't stop this army. Only one I'll listen to so, I'm sorry. It's your fault for losing. We're not balanced, are we? We're not. Them dead. One point. One point. Alchemist of the House of Secrets. Spill their buck. Fight in perfect harmony, bend to Cathay's will. I will not tolerate slow. Wait, two turn? Why? To serve me is a privilege. The dragon blooded. Wait, how come that's two turns? Child of the uh, We'll fight with one less unit. I thought it was gonna be one turn. I'm gonna chase them down. Proving a little bit difficult. Alright, this is the rebel force. That's why we are coming back. Because... Things like this, I can't reach it. It's okay, at least, at least we're safe. Yeah, Scarbrand's here. Warden this is getting a little bit more complicated. Like, clearing out Tong, definitely useful, but is it worth it? And upon them. I take this. Of the storm. We shall defend Cathay. It has the honor of joining Actually balanced. Wow. Balance with the right buildings. Definitely, wow.
Right, Tone's almost done. I think we finished them. There'll still be more than like, you know, seven turns here for us to go into a realm. This will become kind of our front line, but then Nurgle is like all the way. We share a big border with them. It's not nice. <laughs> rescue Tall Tall or not. I think he needs to die. We need to reset Tall Tall. So I'm not going to rescue Tall Tall. We're going to continue our little camp pop here. Sent by our ancestors. Within my yeah, we'll fight this and this next turn and play March to Ice Spear and then we'll contain the damage at I Saber Mountains because they take a turn and take it and then we can retake it, defend. My fury. They're tough, but I think, I think we can beat them. Just like that was a bad set of abilities to get hit by. I shall summon devastation. Yeah, it could have been worse. Let's finish them. Let's end on a positive node. Yeah, what a crappy army. What a small garrison. They gave us Pyrrhic? No respect. Yeah, I feel like Cathay armies are probably super vulnerable to spells just because we have to stay together. I'm probably just going to ignore him. Try to go snipe him. Hmm. Probably like this because we don't want too much of the tree coverage. Warrior crossbows. We could also. Should we do cannons in the front here? Order and balance. And crossbows in the back. I'm tempted to do that because the Get friendly fire situation Cathay. lately. Jade crossbows. Mines as like if one. someone's gonna take friendly fire, it should be these boys. Never conquered. The celestial faithful. All right, everyone got their Inyan bonus. Seven I'm gonna try to snipe their lord. I think I got what it takes. In celestial light. Oh. oh, wow. I will go. Fancy that. Kiss of the spirit dragon. Fire right. in the blood. Then we charge him. We do want reinforcement to arrive, though. They need to rule. Right, we don't want to kill him. Actually, I don't want him to have army loss. God, we're picky. It's like, you can't die yet. It's a good minute for you to live. Ah, it's okay, it's okay. Doesn't really hurt. There we go. Now we can now we can charge him. You die now. Mines as one. Who's the one in the front? Yeah. You get this guy. Celestial Fury. All right, we kill. We're gonna kill him completely. Is he not completely routed? We're gonna cause a delay there using the army one because our caster is really, really far away. I'm gonna use this on him because it's so slow getting him killed. Right, can we get a charge? Clean one? There we go. Coming back, coming back. We got lots of things to do. Summon one here. Light. There. I will 
Go. Summon another one here. Kiss of the spirit dragon. Them a defensive boost. I should just hit hit range units. Maybe I can snipe him. Actually, no, the cannon's got it. Master of the winds. Uh, we can blind them. Eight winds to me. Move in formation. Sent by dragons. Repositioning. Move as wind. All right, Seeking got the blind off. He's off. Order I'm gonna go army. kill him. We'll do an easy one. I oh, he just gone. Oh, that was kind of wasted. All right, make sure he doesn't bounce back. Stone and steel. Cannons should finish him. Should be over. Like a few of them will bounce back, but then like, oh, we don't want to do that. Come back, come back. Dump another summon. It's free. We want our range units to go crazy for a little bit. Every kill is one less we have to deal with in the garrison defense section here. He's gonna die. And that's good enough. Yeah, we lost a lot of peasants, but the range all stayed pretty good, and we killed off all their lords. Their badly damaged should be an easy delegate here. They still have an army roaming outside, so I don't think it wipes them, but um, it will limit their options going forward. And we get a huge replenishment. Sugar. All right, we got ourselves a mission completion. I don't know if we can get any armies from that. Uh, we're gonna be grabbing that. I know there's an army roaming around here, but like I don't have enough info on them. Like I can peek, still have no info. Maybe they're fighting here. I mean, it's not anywhere close to us, so I don't think I can turn around. So until needs to move up, stop Sprague's army here, and then there's like plenty of things for him to fight all over the place. There's like floods of army coming down. We need more armies, and we definitely can't afford them. All right, we're well over 20k. Like we're not even balanced right now. It's like 18k. Um, we can afford at least three, two, two, three armies. I think two armies probably because it's eight percent increase here for every other army. So it's going to be pretty pricey, and we're probably going to have to resolve this issue sometime soon. Um, yeah, that's that's something. We currently have two fluff supply lines that will eventually go away. So maybe three army is doable. We'll see. Uh, but as you can see, we have painted a large portion of the map. We're like making inroads everywhere. Uh, Nurgle is still a big headache. Uh, you can see Katrin has confederated Gestalten. They only have this. They lost all of kids left, to be honest. Um, I don't think they will survive very long here either. Our Dwarven allies have holdings we want. I don't know how to get them. Our brother has an awkward situation. I don't know if we can actually go to... Like, maybe going to war with our brother is not wise. Maybe this army should just go. We need them other places, and this is not going to be a siege because my brother has land here as well. So, like, if I fight him, I have to fight this, and that's just a mess. Maybe I can just buy this from him? If I can do that, then maybe... Yeah, it's not too pricey. So, yeah, that's not going to happen. So, yeah, that's the situation. We got to balance things out. I really want to go into that portal... But now we have Scarbrand units coming down. 
And I, I did pull up the other army, but we also have Nurgles all around us as well. So it's it's tough. It's tough. Tal'Tal's army has just got wiped. Legion of Chaos is no joke. And uh, we also have an ogre problem behind us. we got to go clean that up. But once we do, no more ogre except for Scrag. And uh, we'll go from there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.